and how to get the team motivated, the talent. There's a couple of issues and solutions that I like to highlight. First, most of your transformation projects that you're doing today, they're not a team of people. Just let me be blunt. They're just a group of people and most of them work part-time. They have a role in the transformation in the project. They probably have a role in operations or the business, other sides. Uh, they might be participating in other projects at the same time. And when they work for your project, this is maybe a couple of hours per week or half a day per week. And you have maybe 20, 30 people, they do the same. So this is a group of people. The transformations, most successful transformations succeed when you have a team. I'm a big Real Madrid fan. I love sports. And you can see when a team is playing together, it's a team, it's united. They, they work together in the hard times. They support each other's trust. And that's how you succeed in sports, in, in arts, in music, right? When you are a team, 99% of the transformations, you're seeing through that. They're not a team. They're just a group of people. So the first thing that we should think about when we want to create uh, a, a, a talent and, and a group of people motivated is focus on the team. One of the first thing I do when I join a transformation is forget about the transformation. I, I don't want to talk about the transformation. I, do, I want to work with you team to create a team. Everybody's individual. So spend half a day, one day, just building the team, not about the transformation. And, and then once you spend the time investing on the team, things will go faster, better. They will enjoy it more. Even if they have to work harder, they will love that. We're creating a high-performing team. The other nice advice that I give and I love is, and it's about volunteers, people who volunteer in my transformation. Imagine I'm launching a new product that is sustainable and AI driven. I ask the organization who wants to volunteer and people who volunteer are 100%, even 200% committed because uh, I always say, talk about the purpose of your project. The purpose is not a system. We do a system or a product for a bigger cost. When the purpose resonates with my feelings, with my emotions, then I have that connection that will get me those people really supporting, engaged in the transformation. So think about the why of your transformation and who wants to volunteer and then you really have that group of people becoming a team and high performing team who will drive transformation in the good and in the bad times. Good luck with that.